Get rid of them. Get rid of all of them. Let me tell you why. If you have Onyxes, now is the time to sell them. I'm gonna break down the numbers for you and tell you why you should be selling them right now. But first, I've gotta smash this plate of pizza rolls. Don't worry, it only take me like two, three seconds. Bet that's something you guys didn't know about me. I'm a professional eater. Took me like, what, less than 10 seconds to huff down 50 pizza rolls. Joey Chestnut couldn't have even done it with twice as much time. Dude's a glizzy gobbler anyways. Doesn't even know anything about eating pizza rolls. All right, let's talk about these Onyxes. These bad boys originally released March 5th of 2022. Clean colorway, awesome colorway. All black, super neutral, got the heel tab. When I called these out, I said they were gonna have a ton of value. They were gonna be a good long-term hold. And of course, I listened to myself and copped a few pairs on my own. They retailed for 230. I planned on holding and making maybe 100 bucks a pair. We did see a small restock of these in June whenever the bones released, but nothing too crazy that made the market shift. It didn't really affect the value of the pairs that were already on the market. The Onyxes continued to climb, and still I had no problem holding these. Now we have a little bit of an issue. A lot of these sneaker news pages are rumoring that these are going to restock in November. Now if it's another restock like what we saw in June, nothing to worry about. However, in this case, I believe that we're going to see these go worldwide and we're going to see them in multiple places. Some of these sneaker news pages are saying that we're going to see these again on the confirmed app and at retailers. If these are going to hit the retailers again, then the value of these is going to grow much, much slower than we expected. Unfortunately for resellers, fortunately for those who are trying to cop for personals, to me, it's not worth holding the pairs that you already copped for even longer just to get a couple more bucks. If this restock is is as big as what they're rumoring, then you can cop more pairs in November. Move these now, collect profits, and re-up in November. If you sold these right now on GOAT or StockX, most sizes are gonna clear you around three to $325, which isn't terrible. Per pair, that's a pretty good profit margin. People are always looking for a fresh new pair of all black Yeezys or all white Yeezys, so these are still gonna mature over time, but why wait? Collect your profits now, and here's how you should go about getting the best bang for your buck. I've already listed mine on Instagram. You can list them on Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook pages. List them there first so that you can avoid fees. Whenever you list on Go to Stock X, they might be fetching $350, $360, but you're not gonna get all that back. You're gonna get hit with the fees and the shipping, and in the end, you're gonna clear that $300 to $325 mark like we talked about before. Give yourself a day or two, throw them up on social media, try and fetch another $10 to $20 a pair. If they sell, they sell. If they don't, then we shift over to the other apps. Take some good picks, throw them up on eBay, Try and fetch a little bit better price than what you would get after payouts on apps. And of course, last resort, if you have to, go ahead and sell them on Goat and Stock X. You're still gonna make money there, just not quite as much. I told you guys, whenever you see any rumors of colorways restocking, whether that be an OG silhouette or something like this, that you think that they're gonna flood the market with pairs, move them. If that's really the case, you can always get more. And if not, you still made profit. These ended up being just a six month hold and they're gonna bring me around $100 profit per pair. I have several sizes that I'm trying to move right now. And by the time this video drops, they'll probably all be gone. Make sure you stay up to date with your sneaker news pages about this restock. Stay up to date with my IG. The handle is the same, at Sneakers. If I see any information that's confirmed, whether that be stock levels, a specific date, or whether or not it's even happening, I'll be sure to post that on my IG. There's plenty of stuff going on in the sneaker world right now. If you want to stay up to date with it, make sure you subscribe, turn those notifications on, and stay hip to the sneaker culture. As always, I appreciate the support. Thank you guys for watching, and do not forget, this is all about sneakers.